nearly pulled one round there like he did in the opening set. Yeah, that's the difference now though, isn't it, in Nadal? Two or three of those have just missed the sidelines. They were all, all going in. He was scoring time and time again. And now the error count just rising. Can he find a way? Mr. Bennett challenging the call on the right service line. Was it was long. Very spot on the last time. Couldn't have been closer. This one's probably going to be pretty close too. Call stand. But, uh, 40, 30. Better as one challenge. An old fashioned look, he wasn't sure. Excellent angle. And look at that room wrapper. It may be early January, but he's got the juices flowing, that's for sure. He trails out, 3 2, third set. Last one out the chair, would you believe it? Mikhail Barrera playing with a whole heap of confidence here, and this would be one of the wins of his life. Last time he beat a top 10 player was four years ago. <laughs> beat Burdick in Beijing. He's never beaten a top three player. Pressure on Barrea playing like that. Oh, it's interesting also that Barrea is he's playing aggressively, but he's not over pressing. Because you can feel that the errors are going to come from Nadal at this moment in time. If he can just stay in the rallies, he's selective. Amazing stat there 28 unforced errors from Nadal. I don't think I've ever seen 28 unforced errors, even in a five set match from Rafa. Certainly going to take him some time to get back to his best. That is a wonderful second serve there from Mikhail Barret. No holding back at all. See lefties, they hate that kicker out in the juice court, out to the backhand side. It's too loose there. Standout serve. Four games to Ace two. number six, and he's two games away from what would be the win of his career. Remember, he's been on the tour now some 16 years. Yeah, more importantly, I think also, there's no signs of really any tension, is there? If anything, Barrera's getting more and more confident as the contest progresses. Another sign of it, then. 
a good little change up, yeah, really, really caught the dial unawares. It increasingly difficult to penetrate through Barrera, but he managed it well there with those two forehands. <laughs> Crucial moments now. First serve points wouldn't go amiss. Oh. So uh, treated with disdain. rally unorthodox finish but the Dal does what he had to do keeps involved he's still a breakdown but it's only a breakdown so rest still a break to the good Thank you. There's no timing at all in that last shot from Rafa. Challenge that. Anxious moments. Call is overturned. Replay the point. Fifteen.
has made it. What a shot from him. Perfect control. As good as anything that Rafa's 30, hit towards 15. him. Yeah, that's an exceptional shot there. This is a pretty good approach there from Nadal. But to get that ball up and over Nadal's head, it's such a low approach as well. Very well to bring it back inside to the baseline. And what a confidence builder that is. again this is a guy ranked 127 in the world you wouldn't believe it from watching this well it's about belief isn't it and that's the difference i mean to begin with he was completely overwhelmed and now he believes he can win this match nailed it At the age of 34, 16 years on the tour, he's a game away from the win of his career. So it's worth persevering, is the yeah. moral of the story. Nadal serving to stay in the match after an hour and three quarters. two sets error after error So it was definitely measuring. And again, very well watched. If you can get through this game immense pressure on Barrea. It's held up to the pressure so well that it'll be doubled serving for the match. Court. Still, he couldn't find it. You know, he just lost his penetration off the ground, though, Nadal, hasn't he? I mean, you know, we talked about the margins over the, the net earlier on and how much sort of air he gives the ball, but uh, usually it's more offensive than it is. And you know, Barrera, is, is not only is he sort of chasing down the angles, he's adding, adding extra purchase off the ground, too. And certainly, Nadal, really out of sorts. Make sure no prisoners now. <laughs> 40, 30. Thank <laughs> you. 
still giving it absolutely everything, Rafa. And he does force Barrera to serve out for this match. Better lead. Five games to four. Wonder whether Barrera's head is spinning right now. He's coped with it all admirably. How is he going to cope with this? New balls. Will that help or hinder him? Old second serve. Not 15. His first double fault. Loading up on the serve right now. slow down it's too aggressive yeah it's all of a rush isn't it just needs a bit more composure the Nadal fans are having to calm themselves there's a whisker of an opportunity Perez determined to play this game on his terms 15 13 well he's not shying away from it that's the point isn't it I mean, he's not pushing the ball Still playing aggressive tennis. Great defense from Barrera, but look at Rafa. And now he's got a chance to level up here in set number three. It's monumental hitting. Oh, Nadal bringing the perspiration and certainly the inspiration as well. That's how much it means to him. I think he wants to win. Pretty keen. There's one back. Thirty, forty. Terrific response. It was a good serve. Thought Rafa might get onto it then. Two break points and two first serves as well. It's not often you see Nadal miss, uh, not get either of them back in play. And there's a bit of a change up in pace there. 162 kilometers an hour, not particularly quick either. Just fooled Nadal. Hasn't served a double fault all match, and now serving for the match, there's a couple in the game. Advantage, Nadal. Thank you, thank you. That's a great forehand. That was a Nadal-type forehand. Yeah, that's such a good point. Really, using all the angles. I mean, the first forehand was pretty smart, taking Nadal right out, opens up the court, and here... It's really, really positive tennis. I'm a big Rafa fan, but, you know, right now, 
just feel that Barrera deserves this. And he's now a point away from it. He's continued to take it to Rafa. No backward step in sets two and three. And here he is then. Four minutes shy of two hours with match point for the biggest win of his career. Thank you, ladies and gentlemen. Thank you. It is out. And he has got it. And his compatriot, Dustin Brown, absolutely thrilled for him.